and it's lollygag to you. That should be good. So in these two matches I want to show you, they're from a while ago, but I really liked what happened to them. So regular in my chat picked this build, which is inner strength or inner healing, quick and quiet, decisive strike and head on. And I was able to really utilize the perks in chase. Anyways, please enjoy these matches. Cool, right in front of a gen. No. Just kidding. <laughs> You don't know. Whatever, I waste your time. That's fine with me. Nia, time waster. Normally, at this point in my, my life, I'm just like, gents before totems, gents before totems, but gosh, diddle it, dang it, when you run that inner strength. Ooh. Nice. You don't, you don't see any of this. You did not see any of this. Oh, that's unfortunate. And let's see if I can get the, the tasty head on play. Not a locker checker. And then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to get rid of his portal first. Portal first. Questions later. Questions mean heals. On to here we go. And she's got prove thyself. Mwah. Beautiful. Mm, she's downed again. Unfortunate. And she definitely doesn't have DS anymore. Hello, motherfucker. Hi. I know. I know. I'm throwing this down now. Head on, head on, head on. Did you not hear the loud ass notification of head on? Yeah, he's gonna go ahead and eat that. I'm gonna go ahead and go in the corn. All right, over here on main. I don't know where he went. Fine with me. <clears throat> That's right. <sighs> Come on, Raptor boy, I gotta make you proud. You pick this build, baby. Let's go. He's got me here. Not if I do that, though. We're on the 50-50s now. Quick and quiet is really messing this guy up. Back up. There we go. Patches right here. <sighs> Damn it. She wasn't ready. This is a dumb move. I can't. I don't have head on loaded up. I wanted my inner strength. I was I was hoping quick and quiet. That was my hope, is that quick and quiet was loaded up, but I didn't pay attention to that. I want to see if I can get healed mid chase. Nice. Demo, please. We can talk about this. Buddy. Fuck your life! All right, that person needs to get the gate. You need to open the gate that's near here. Unless you have a key and everything's going to be hunky dory. I do appreciate you guys. Do you commend your efforts immensely? <laughs> Careful, she's. <laughs> please. Nice on the BT. Let's go. Do you got this gate open or what? Do you have this gate open or what? Oh, you do actually. Live gamer. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Demogorgon. Thank you very much. Good job, everyone. So for the second match, I was requested to run this perk build right here. The first three perks are pretty standard. Iron Will, you're quiet. Resilience, you do everything 15% faster while injured. And then Sprint Burst, you know that one. But the perk that really came in clutch and handy was Stakeout. 
If you don't know what stakeout is, it's pretty much for every 15 seconds you stand in the killer's terror radius and you're not in a chase, you get tokens and you can up to four tokens. And then each token, when you do a good skill check, it's considered a great skill check and you consume a token. So if you can get these tokens loaded up, you can knock out gens really quickly. All right, we got the tasty Ormond. Oh, that's right, we're uh, hey, Nia, already on the already on the chest. Is there ruin? <laughs> Thanks, Nia. Now all of China knows you're here. Dang it. Ah! Oh, Dead by Daylight. Love you. Great stuff. Great stuff, Dead by Daylight. Great stuff. I would like to get myself healed. Oh, but I also... Oh, Forsaken DC'd! Awesome! Getting my, uh... My little tokens, though. Give it to Another me. one. And there's my fourth stack. Alright, let's see how quickly we can get this Jenna done. Oh, very nice. The Ruin's gone. I'm gonna kind of just try to stay out of sight, out of mind. Yeah, look at that. Great skill check. Here's the one. So I wanted to fast forward this bit because a lot of it is just repairing a generator, but I wanted to show you the trapper has distressing, which means that his tear radius is larger, which means I'm able to still get all of these stakeout tokens while also repairing a gen and staying nearby. I go from one gen to another because he's patrolling the area, but you can see how quickly I'm able to get through these generators because of stakeout. Yeah, I guess I'll just hang out and work on this gen because the other person is healed, so they should kind of go for it, you know? He's definitely trapped the area up. Yeah, there's my tokens. I'll just hang out, get my tokens. Get my tokens, do the gen, you know. Call an ambulance! Call an ambulance! But not for me! My gen! My gen, let's do it! Still three tokens, yo. Let's do it, let's go. I keep hitting great skill checks. I don't, I don't need to. We'll save it for the last gen, I guess. Great skill check again. Boom. Follow me. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Follow me. Wow, look at this build clutching it. Ah! They're getting worried. Can you get the gate? Yeah, this ain't gonna work. There's no way with resilience. Oh my god, Sophie. Flattern. Need to take a hit! Need to take a hit! Need to take a hit! Oh my god, Nia! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! With the DC. <laughs> Do you even get hooked? No, I did not. Oh, Kevin, it's just like easy. I'm just like, um, you only killed one person. Hey, thanks for watching. I'm really trying to put forth an effort to get these videos out to one, try to get present and current and two, so you guys can enjoy more content more often. Anyways, I stream on Twitch three days a week. So pop on in sometime. Who knows? Maybe you'll see a match that gets put up on YouTube. Anyways, it's your gal Lollygag signing off.